to the champions of Werribee Virtual Footy Clinic for today, guys. I am Michael Barlow, part of the Werribee Football Club. We've got a very, very special guest joining us today. And without any further ado, we're going to introduce him. Adelaide footballer, plays fullback, Kyle Hardigan. He used to play at Werribee, so we've got him down. He used to be from the area. And he's going to be our guinea pig today, doing all the exercises and all the challenges. So Kyle, first of all, Welcome to the Champions of Werribee session. Mate, how did you end up playing for Werribee Football Club? Thanks Mick, uh, I'm not sure what Champions of Werribee uh, suits me, but um, I uh, ended up playing at Werribee um, from, coming from the Western Jets um, in the TAC Cup underage competition and then, uh, yeah, it was time to take the next step. I wasn't drafted, so I um, wanted to keep furthering my football. So. Um, came down to Werribee and started training. Um, at the time there was an alignment with uh, Williamstown, so um, it was a bit of a tough task to get here. Um, but uh, the general manager, Mark, of, of Werribee pulled some strings late in the piece and um, made a deal with Williamstown, which got me uh, over the line to play at Werribee. That's brilliant. So you're at Werribee. What numbers did you wear when you played for Werribee? I wore number 45 in my first year and then I moved into the number 18. Number 45 and number 18, so I'll get you the Hold that one up, there's 45, this is what he used to wear for Werribee and AA. I'm going to get you to put that on, Kyle, because we haven't got any of your Adelaide gear, so we may as well put you in your Werribee gear. Okay, so what is one of the what main things that you learnt at your time at Werribee? Um, I guess probably um, just to uh, I probably learn about hard work here. And, um, I had a number of different coaches, so they uh, all instilled different. Um, philosophies in me and that sort of thing, but um, definitely uh, hard work because um, I had a job while I was here as well, I was an electrician, so coming from that and then coming to training was um, definitely a lot harder than the, probably what you're used to in the AFL industry now, um, and then also the mateship as well, like um, coming to training with uh, 45 of your best mates um, was awesome um, most nights of the week, so um, that mateship and that camaraderie between the boys was, was awesome at this footy club. Brilliant. Now he's in Adelaide and now he's going to take you guys through a virtual workout, okay? So if you've got a football, that is absolutely brilliant. Kyle's got his footy ready to go. We're going to do a little bit of exercise and then we're going to do some skills with the footies, okay? So if you haven't got a footy, and I understand a lot of you at home or at school wouldn't have a footy, Kyle's brought in something that you could use and you could just grab out of your bedroom. What do you draw, Kyle? Yeah, Vic, I've got uh, my socks here, so something that won't scratch the walls at home and that sort of thing. So I've got the MND socks here that I wore last year, training at, at Adelaide. So um, yeah, you can just chuck these on the boot at home and uh, you can handball, kick, whatever, whatever you like. That's it, so we get creative if you haven't got a footy. So let's just warm up to start off with Kyle. I want to jog you on the spot, jog on the spot at home there, at school, then lifting your knees. Okay, when I blow my whistle, you're gonna go as fast as you can for five seconds, high knees. Okay? Three, two, one. Fast as you can. Good, fast, 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 fast. And stop. Okay, just jog on the spot again. Now we're gonna kick our, kick our butts. So kick our butts. And again, on the whistle, we're going to kick, kick our butts as quick as we can for five seconds. Three, two, one. All right, get going. Go, 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 go. Very good. Nearly there, nearly there. And rest, okay. Very good, heart rate up. Well, yeah, heart rate's up for Kyle, so we're ready to go. First activity, okay, at home, so just jumping down on our knees with our ball or with our object, okay? We're going from our knees to our feet as quick as we can. We're kicking our object and we're going back to our knees. Back onto our feet, kick our object, back onto our knees. We're gonna do this for 30 seconds, okay? Ready, set, go! See, I've got my coach hat on today, so I get to coach the Adelaide fullback, Kyle Hardigan, and I don't have to do the exercises because I've got the whistle on the coach. Good work, Kyle, keep going. Faster, faster. Who are, who are some of the fastest teammates that you've played with in the AFL? Yeah, look, I'm pretty fast myself. <laughs> nah, um, she's uh, fastest teammates. Paddy Dangerfield's pretty quick. Paddy you know, Dangerfield. Pat, so I'll pick that name up. Uh, probably uh, Mad Jack Daw, who I played with at Werribee. Mad Jack Daw. He's pretty quick as well. Um, 
On three, four, two, one. Okay, have a little rest. Now, we've got a footy. Now for Kyle, I've got a soccer ball. Soccer ball and a tennis ball. Okay, so you're going to start with the soccer ball. Chuck me the football. So for the challenge, whatever you've got at home, I want you to do this as well. Going to see how many times Kyle can juggle the soccer ball and keep it off the deck before he hits the ground. Okay, three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, and up it goes over into the window. Okay, so your turn now at home or at school. Whatever you've got, it might be tough with a bit of a pair of socks, but you know what? We're going to make Kyle do it with the socks that he brought in. So you guys at home in three, two, one, have a go. As Kyle's going to have a crack now with his socks. Three. I'll see if he can beat three. Okay, ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, we give it to him. Okay, very good. Pause there at home, pause there at school. Back in, back into our knees to feet as quick as we can. This time, when we get to our feet, I want us to handball and clap the ball. Handball, handball, clap, catch the ball. Okay, ready? You're going to use the socks you brought in. Set. Go! So knees to feet, nice and fast. Knees to feet, handball, clap. Knees to feet. So Kyle mentioned he used to play footy with Mad Jack Daw, who now plays at North Melbourne. Did you ever, he's a forward, you're a back, did you ever play on Mad Jack? Uh, yeah, I played on Mad Jack a little bit, but he kicked a couple of goals, so I handed him over to someone else and made sure it looked like someone else was playing on him. That's what defenders do. Defenders like to make everyone else's problem. Couple more, Kyle. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, now we're going to juggle with the footy. Okay, so his record with the soccer ball was five. I think I might have been a bit generous there. So five. Let's see if he can go for more than five with the footy. Three, two, just go back on that line. One. That's one, two, three, four, four, five, six, six. Okay, you guys have a crack while Kyle runs over about 50 metres away and gets his footy. So ready, set, go, have a go. We'll see if Kyle can beat six. Two, three. No, he can't. These kids at school and home, they're still going. We're going to have to cut them off. All right, grab your footies, grab your object, and grab a drink. Okay, so that is half time of our workout. Grab yourself a drink of water. Uh, have a little bit of a walk around while we get our heart rate down. Okay, so just walking around. Nice deep breaths. Okay, we're going to get into our next activity, okay? So our activity this time is, we're just jumping from side to side, landing on one foot. But as we land, I want us to pretend we're walking with the footing. Okay, walk. Four, landing on one foot. Okay, so we're going to get going in 10 seconds. Kyle's a, Kyle's a fullback. So for you guys that know footy, they don't really do many balks. They, all they like to do is punch. Okay, so we're going to see if Kyle's any good at balking as a fullback. Three, two, one. Go, good work. Nice. Yeah, he's not too bad. How many walks have you done in your career? Plenty, mate. Plenty. Yeah. Plenty? It's not you. It's looked up to you. So <laughs> mate, we're every player. You did plenty of walks. Plenty of walks. Fake myself more than anyone else. Okay. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Have a little rest there, guys. Now, I can hear what you're all saying. If they're at school or at home. Kyle, he's a big man. Big, strong. Big, strong man. How many push-ups do you think he can do in 30 seconds? We're about to find out. This is the challenge. So Kyle's going to lay down here in front of the three values of the Werribee Football Club. And on my whistle, he's going to start his push-ups. You are going to race him at home or at school. 30 seconds. How many can you do? Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. He's halfway. 
22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37 we'll give him. Well done, give him a round of applause. Great stuff. So 37, I'm hearing some voices from the schools. The record was, well, 170. That is huge. 170 push-ups in 30 seconds. Brilliant. Okay. Now Kyle's going to grab his socks that he's brought in. Same thing, we're going to do speed skater, sorry. So speed skater, and this time we're going to handball it on one, on one foot. Handball it each time you go side to side. Okay, ready, set, go. Handball, handball, very good. Very, really good guys, keep working. Not long to go now. Not long to go now. Couple more. Three, two, one. Okay, good. Little breath, little rest, nice deep breaths. Shut me your socks there, Kyle. We're going to do a 30 second challenge now. You're racing Kyle. We're just going to see how many times you can handball. We're going to actually make it handball, clap. How many times you can handball, clap, and catch the ball in 30 seconds? Okay, we're going to go in five seconds. Get ready. Three seconds, no one false starting. Two, one, go. One, two, three. Kyle, you can, you can count for me. Six, seven, eight. I've got him parked. I've got him parked. You guys are working hard at it. Good work. Okay, keep going, keep going. Seven, eight, nine, ten. There you go. Nearly there. Good work. Three, two, one. 29. 29, just under one handball a second. Okay, I prepared some questions earlier for Kyle. We call this the fast five. So that is us done, working out. Well done. But we're going to ask Kyle fast five questions, okay? So listening in there at school or at home, I want a really quick answer from you, Kyle. Okay, where did you meet your wife? Uh, Essendon. Essendon. What about your favourite place to visit in Werribee? Oh, I don't have to be at Pacific Werribee for sure. Yeah, go shopping at Pacific Werribee. What all about your needs? Got all your needs there. Absolutely. What's your favourite place you've been on been to on a holiday? Uh, probably um, Machu Picchu in Peru. Machu Picchu. Yeah. Has anyone been there? Not me. What about the toughest opponent you've ever played on? Uh, that would have to be uh, probably Bud Luck, Buddy, Buddy Franklin. Lance Swan Franklin, an absolute superstar. Now, how did you go at maths at school? Terrible. Okay. If Adelaide had kicked seven goals and 11, what is their score? Uh, and that's all we have time for. Three, three, two, 44. Uh, 54. Seven goals, 11, 54, Kyle's got with. The answer is... 53. Oh. So, where did you say you went to school? Ah, uh, no worries, Essendon and Keelor College, great school, great big program. So, Essendon and Keelor College. What about primary school? Ah, uh, Taylor's Lakes. Taylor's Lakes. Now, we've got to probably send in uh, a few questions to those schools around their maths programs. But, Kyle, absolutely brilliant working out with us today, answering our questions. We're going to go, let you go get ready for our handball competition. So, you go get ready. And on behalf of us at Werribee Football Club, thanks for joining in the workout today. I hope you've got a little bit of a sweat, a little bit of uh, skill with your footballs, all your objects you had. Um, and we'll be right back with Kyle Hardigan doing the Werribee Champion Handball Challenge. Okay, back to our Champions of Werribee Handball Challenge. Okay, so Kyle Hardigan, now from the Adelaide Football Club, he's got three handballs on the right hand. Three handballs on the left hand, I'm not, not sure how they're going to go. You get ten points if it goes to the middle. Seven on the outer ring and five on that ring. If he misses that, he gets zero because he's absolutely useless. So, six handballs. We're going to start with your th three right. Let's go. So five. Uh, seven. It's got to go straight through for it. Ten. So now on your left. Oh, 10, 10, and 10, brilliant, well done. So that is 40 plus 7 plus...
plus five. 52. 52, well done. So Kyle Hardigan, 52 on the Werribee, uh, champions of Werribee Handball Tony. Thank, again, thanks for joining us, Kyle, and I'll let you take us out with the kids there at school and at home. Now, thanks for having me, Mick, and um, make sure you study hard at home, guys. Um, thanks to Werribee Footy Club, um, and yeah, listen up to all these teachers, boys and girls. Catch you later. Right, see you guys, enjoy your day.